Welcome to the Michigan Golfer Show. Join us each week as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great game. Welcome to Fox Hills and our grand opening of our new performance center. Yes! And Kathy, you've got a lot going on today, but let's talk about the clubhouse. It's all new and different. It is new and different. And today is our uh, grand opening, our, our unveiling of a whole new look. We've been in business here at the Golden Fox for 25 years. And uh, our young, uh, my daughter and my niece said it's time for a reason. I mean, a big reason. And even though we've done modest reviews in the past, this is a slightly different look. We've gone from the light woods to the dark woods, which are very inlaid in it. And we have new carpeting, new wall covering, we're going to get new artwork, and just kind of a whole new feel to the golden fox that we're hoping to appeal to a much younger audience that is into the more, more very beautiful chandeliers. Um, they're edgy and fun, and they are great firm out of Detroit, who is actually responsible for some of the changes that the DIA uh, has a kind of design, and he came in with a lot of great ideas, so we're really pleased with the outcome. Well, the windows here have always been so beautiful. I remember checking it out when my daughter was getting married, but the dates were all filled up, so we couldn't come here, but... That's the first thing I noticed, and it's still beautiful, the window up. Yeah, and I think they do attract a lot of brides and grooms. I think the open look of the premises just makes such a difference in the feel of the room. No matter what the weather is like, whether it is dismal or whether it's snowing or whether it's sunny, it's just a great room. It sure is, and that's not the only thing you have going on today. Can you tell us a little bit too about the, the brand new building, the performance center building? Oh, absolutely. We're really thrilled about the expansion of our whole learning center. Um, it now includes a new uh, 7,000 square foot building. Uh, we have six new days. We have a cutting room where you can learn how to cut better. And uh, a massage room and also just a nice extra room to do classes and things like that. So we're uh, excited. We're going to be unveiling it today. We have state-of-the-art equipment, and we'll be giving demonstrations done at the Performance Center in, uh, in a little while. So you can go down and actually see all the, the um, new electronics. And that's just a compliment to the fabulous teaching pros you have there at the learning center. Can you mention a word or two about Jordan White? Oh, yes, Jordan is fabulous. He's, he's our head at director of instruction, and he has announced a wonderful team of instructors, including Chad Ellis, Bradley Kim, uh, Will Ellinger, Jeff Goebel, and Guyla, Joelle Harding. They are all fabulous instructors and doing comments, so let me leave that doing comments. So we have some great teaching professionals. We're really proud of the work that they do, and we're really excited about the new season that we're going to be undertaking. We're going to be doing a lot of clinics and our children's programs as well as adult programs. I mean, we really run the game you sure do, and you've been busy with great results. Kathy, thanks for talking with us. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So, you have quite a few instructors and you can teach people 
all kinds of things that I understand. Putting studio. Yeah, if you want to go find studio, I'm going to go to the cold or the candy in Michigan. We also have brand new sofa in the back. It's a beautiful uh, studio up here for the new support box. It's a fantastic. A good new team from Brenda Bay, Canada, by way of Eastern Michigan golf team, right? So that's that. I graduated in 94, played four years there, the stadium was year long. And uh, now I'm close to the stadium. So I'm close to the stadium. And you have to bring up one other thing that's kind of cool about your background, and that's that you um, met and played some golf with Mo Norman. People don't know is a legend. A lot of people don't know Mo, but uh, I was lucky enough to utilize Pasta and uh, do some shows for them, and uh, there were a lot of stories. And uh, he loves just the pimping that was nice to me. And nobody could play to golf all the way he could. He was amazing. I mean, stories were all true. Uh, I still tell the stories. I mean, he was unbelievable. And uh, obviously, you missed him. But uh, he was spectacular. So, speaking of spectacular, uh, what is the future of the equipment in the future of Well, this is the designated V1 day, and uh, we're pretty close. Uh, the V1 partners uh, next door is only about half a mile down the road. This product, Jerry Paddock, and the crew there, they provide us with all the witty parts of your software. So we have that in all of our days. And uh, maybe we have a problem with this yellow thing that we have on our other days, so it's perfect. <laughs> so, um, the technology includes video of people doing text for your swings so you can collect it. Yeah, we, we video most swings and then we create an online lock for us. So that people can log in and watch the text for us. And the lock is just a component. So they can go ahead and host them. And they can use the online license, all the reviews, and then they can use the sort of course of one, two, three, or five years. So it's always a kind of nice. We also have a body plan for the game system of the customer. Uh, we also use the place for technology. And uh, we have an on site for this um, training system that's on the plan. It's pretty cool with the internet and the hardware. Well, we believe that uh, golf is about being fit and becoming an athlete first. And then what we can do is we put out a lot of things for our kids and our adults and we can do it for them. So if we can move fast and move efficiently, then we need to go to golf. And so it kind of helps us to move. Now, if you get hurt, you just go yell for him and then he comes right on over. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Well, what else should we look at here? Okay, so here we have in our uh, day two, we have our body track system. And it's a really neat map system that uh, takes a look at cluster in the ground. So, as you can see over there on the screen, on the B1 screen, body track and B1 work together. And as David's kind of moving around here, there's a white dot. And the white dot is the average pressure that he's putting vertically into the ground. His percentage is a certain parts of the swing, whether it be the beginning of the swing, the top of the swing, or the top of the swing. And so whether it's a, it's a young child at, at 10, 9, 8 years old, they can make some changes and can move them dynamically. Or whether you're a really good player like David here, who's a scratch golfer, we can certainly train them to move better, more efficiently, and obviously better. So this is one of my favorite names, this is kind of like the photo of the bill. And um, it's designed so that we can have two kids sitting and two adults sitting in one station and two in another, and it's kind of like a clean thing. So we can have up to four or five people in the same town, one or two places. We can use uh, flight stores, we can use body tracks, we can use the V1 system, and uh, it's just another fun for us to work with. Well, the first time I heard the word cutting in studio in the same sentence was here. So, can you tell us about it? Well, this is a nice room in uh, uh, the lab, and obviously, we all want to be in the same lab here that we can you know, set some standards for the different meetings as far as the place there. Not to make people want to be thinking about what they're going to do some of the time, but we can certainly help them with the other ways to do it in the studio. Uh, it's on the railing here, which is nice. We can control the temperature, and it's not in the room, so it's a good spot. And uh, we have multiple holes here, 
Driving ranges and having horses don't give you a chance to do the things that really matter. Can you talk a little bit about why having a special place would work? Well, I think, you know, when Brian and I think of Tolkien, we think of trying to get lost somewhere for a few hours and, you know, and, and really trying to take them away from it and enjoy the area. And this little area here is kind of a little bit away from the way. It's kind of a nice little desperate area. Very, very good. For different locations, different kinds of jobs, putting, chicken, yes, real greens, four great bunkers, all kinds of different jobs. So we designed this with the design of Mike Musa and his team so that we could do uh, four and five person clinics, one on one lessons, uh, where members can come out and ask the youth to fill it any time. So, multi purpose box facility, all kinds of different jobs in the field. It's a very important. So, well, where do you start when somebody says, Can you talk on my foot? One foot from the other. If you take a piece of cut, you take a foot, you get a deal with the cut. I've got a bite of it, how do you think it's nice? You know, it's a little bit tight. So, you start close and then back away as people get better? Gradually, um, people are always thinking, Just the foot is good. Well, the foot is good. There's only some women in the last one. Okay, let's go take a look just in case. So, Brian, what's that old saying mean, dry food, show it, and cut for a day? Yes. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, do people need to make appointments to come here? We have daily food, $30 daily food, and then we have three more on the next And the number six includes it, who's the uh, renter. So, that's second. And we provide them with the balls. This time is their sponsor. So they get yellow balls out here. So they want their members to know. You know what? This was a really fun place to learn how to get it off. Thank you so much for talking with us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.